It's time for reinforcements. And gentlemen, you may simply know me as Logamus Prime, and welcome back to you all truly doing the reaction thing to Attack on Titan. Today, I'll be checking out the first OVA for Attack on Titan. I want to believe that the name is pronounced Ease. Eyes. Eyes sounds more plausible. I don't know. Eyes is notebook. So, I guess we're going to be checking out someone's diary journal something seeing their perspective with the squad regiment now i don't remember a character by the name of eyes or ease I, I, whatever is just pronounced i don't remember and honestly i don't even know the take of the ovas i don't know what character it's about i don't know if it's going to be centering around a situation that happened in the season i'm coming in completely blind and i just i can't wait to check it out and see for myself i'm enjoying the attack on Zion hype train I kind of took my time with it. All those years of people recommending this show uh, to me and I kept ignoring them. I, I'm not going to be part of the hype. I bet the show sucks. And no, I, I am, I, I bear witness that I was very rushed wrong and the show is very addicting. <laughs> so alright guys, without further ado, let's dive in. Let's check out this OVA see what it's all about. Also, we're getting a recap of season one, maybe? Oh, mommy. Fairly too soon? Yeah, there's new recruits. Oh, there's G. About so five years later. Wait, what? What is this? This is new. Oh my god, this is, uh... The excavation, or whatever you want to call it, right before um, they got attacked by the female Titan, right? So this is when Orwin put the, the most battle cry of all faces, and he showed again. She's so excited to be more Titans. Well, so this OVA is going to actually have the theme song playing? Again! Why not just put this in the main show? Wait, is this taking place? In between, when they were... Nope, let me stop. Why is she complaining? Shut your lip, lady! Yeah, calm down. Don't talk to the commander like that. Oh my god, this lady and her titans. Oh, so this is gotta be before her little pet projects. Right. I think I have an idea where this is taking place. I was trying to put in a timeline together. I think this takes place right when... This is way before uh, Aaron joins the, the Scouts Regiment. And we, this is the first time we see Levi coming back, right? Uh, this guy's complaining about not being able to take time to live. <laughs> uh, why would you... Why would you create a scenario where Levi wants to fight Oreo? I don't get it. <gasps> Why he created this weird scenario? Oh, okay, hold up. Okay, alright. You find a weakness that you exploit, got it. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so what's her point with this? What is her metaphor here? Oh my god, look, it's freaking Petra! Ooh, I'm not ready for this. Oh my god, if I could, like, tell her from the future, like, hey, retire, go home! So he smells something? What? What, what does he smell? Man, he's ready to reload. Oh, he's throwing... He's warning them. This girl is nuts! And I'm surprised they're going after her. Oh my god, look at this weird tight! Oh my god, look at this big head! <gasps> oh my <laughs> what the fuck? How do you walk into a tree? Oh my god, you are a very dumb titan! Hans, you gotta pay attention in front of you. And look, that's the forest that they went to when they were fighting Annie, right? Ooh, that's Levi. I guarantee you, Levi's gonna kill the Titan. He's not gonna... 
They're not trying to let Hans capture a Titan. I don't know why. Huh? The motherfucker just gave up. Or is he scared of something? <laughs> Yo, this lady needs to go to the break. Baby girl, what are you doing? Stop chasing this weird thing! Just find a random dude and do experiments on them, you know what I'm saying? I guess she likes some bang. <laughs> you are know saying, woo! Alright, what's with the tray? What is with this Titan? What? What are you doing? She's actually walking to. Oh my baby Jesus! Yo, stop! This is not a hamster! It's not a pet! Oh! That's it, you're dead. You're gonna get. Oh my god, Oreo would have died! That's it, Levi's killing him. He's dead. Oh my god. <laughs> You follow your elders forever, Oh, Stop that! The zoo. This girl's talking about. Oh, you're four high, bitch. <laughs> you want to end up as tight and shit? Oh, don't endanger his men. Hunch, no, yo, bro. Oh my gosh, she's being a smartass. She's talking about Titans don't take shits. I'm done with you. Oh. Something's happening. Petra? Did a time do what? What is she talking about? What is that? <gasps> what? She doesn't... They don't have a head? Oh, there's a notebook. Oh, okay, so this is why the OVA is named after the soldier. So what the hell was the Titan after? Whoa. <gasps> so we're gonna actually see it from her perspective too? Okay, this baby girl. Oh, so on her way back there's a bunch of times she just probably skedaddled. Oh. Why did she leave everything behind? Oh, it was damage? So she just ran north? Damn, can you imagine being abandoned? Or at least left to your own vices. In the land of the Titans. I'll be shedding bricks. By the way, it's very unnatural for someone to be running and writing at the same time. I just don't see that happening. She's gonna waste a lot of paper. She's gonna be scribbling all messed up, bleak. She's gotta have some serious good handwriting. She just writes while she's running. I can believe Titans and all this mystery thing. But someone running! Why? <laughs> someone running while they're writing is just not possible to me. Look at this guy! Look at him! What is he doing? Oh! <laughs> right up in the wrong neighborhood, G! Oh god, stop breathing at her! You're so screwed. I bet that dude just bit her head off. Why would the Titan not attack her? She's straight up breathing on you, man! Oh my god! You're just weird. What?! What?! Yo! It talks? I want to see what Hodge just. I want to see Hodge's reaction. Emir Sama? It it's that it's it's saying that's its name. Whoa! And he's bowing. What the fuck? Yo! There's no way. She's asking the Titan some questions. He's crying. What the fuck? Why are you screaming at him? Wow! What the fuck is happening? 
Maybe I have it all wrong. What if it's a... Oh my god! And you're writing that? Who the fuck writes in a notebook when you're getting your head squished? Oh my god! Why? Oh, she's not a toothpick. I wanted to see her face when she heard that the Titan talked. That is not the reaction I expected from her. Disappointed. This is gonna give her even more like energy to want to capture Titans alive. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Fucking tight and bit her head off, but then put her there like a fucking toy. Why did he do that? See, Erwin has a good heart. You know, he he, he let her have her toys eventually. <laughs> Where the hell is she going? Oh, she went to her parents. Oh, this is gotta be the hardest part about being a soldier. Oh no! And they gave the parents her notebook. So, wouldn't you want to keep that information classified? Oh, look at Oreo. <laughs> I guarantee you they're there like, alright, let's go get you some Titans, alright? We, we got you, Hans. You good chick, you good chick. <laughs> God, she is like a, a manhandler person. Man-eater, you know what I'm saying? Oh, never say your life is cheap again. Best advice ever! Whenever you're sad, you're okay! Oh my god, you almost killed him! <laughs> and he bit his tongue! Damn you, Oreo! Okay, look! So Orin came up with the decision finally. Yep, there you go. He's like, alright, you can have some damn toys! Whoa, dude, guys, this episode was solid. It gave us a lot, a lot of good information. I did not expect this out of this OVA, and god, I've been watching a lot with the One Punch Man's My Hero Academia's Doku Go OVAs. This one was really good. Take that, other animes. <laughs> Let's just recap what happened in today's episode, and then I discuss some serious theories. Pretty much today's episode was just pretty, uh, was just Hanj, uh, begging her little Lord Commander, Erwin, that, yo, we need to go capture some damn time so I can experiment on them figure what the fuck they're all about. But Erwin's like, yo, we, we don't we don't need to put people in danger for some dumb shit like that. Let's just kill them and just be done with it. And Hans is like, no, but I really want some. And Erwin's like, no. And then she just stormed off and just dealt with it. Then she saw a Titan, or at least heard one, and chased after it. It's some weird little tiny little Titan with a big ass head. She was trying to capture it, but then Levi and the gang showed up and they're like, nah, we ain't gonna like you do that. But then the Titan just stopped chasing Hans and then freaking it was turning to the opposite. The Titan ran away and Hans started chasing after it. She led the rest of the group to this little tiny forest area, this meadow. There was a tree there and I guess there was a dead soldier there. And also her notebook. And before you can say sexy, Levi shows up and freaking kills that little Titan. Hans takes that notebook, she reads over it, and yeah, it discusses the last two days of that soldier who died by that tree. She discusses how she met this one Titan who actually spoke English, spoke, spoke actual words, which is crazy. The Titan ended up killing her anyway. <laughs> but for whatever reason, the Titan kind of like either took mercy or started worshipping the, the person's body and and gave it a nice resting place, like a little memorial, you know? Regardless, the fucking Titan still killed her. But pretty much that was the gist. We actually got to know that a Titan actually spoke English. The word that the Titan spoke to the person was Emer. I know enough about my Greek god and my Norse mythology. Those stories are amazing. I mean, without the, without Greek gods, without Norse mythology, we'll never have Superman, Batman, and even anime. So even those myths and legends are so important to today's storytelling. But I advise, if you guys don't know much about it, go check them out. They're freaking amazing stories. But Emir is also very fascinating, especially Norse mythology and now in Attack on Titan, because Emir is a freaking being that when fire and ice met, you know, he turned into his huge shit, and giants were falling off of him, and 
yo, he, he's a really cool character. So, like, if you tie that mythology into Attack on Titan, then maybe it, it could make sense. Like, could there be... Could there be a giant out there? Could there be a being that created the Titans and humans, you know? Or, or maybe they're all one in the same. This blew my mind now because it's like the first time we actually get some context of what a Titan can be. Maybe this is a cycle. Maybe this is a curse. Maybe Titans are damned humans. You know, stuck in limbo, like not being able to like think or breathe or whatever. Maybe this is why we always see them smiling and happy when in reality they're just suffering inside. And this first Titan that we saw is the reality of that. It's just a Titan fighting this, fighting that, I don't know, curse of, of not wanting to feed off humans or not wanting to fight humans. God, this fucking OVA has blew my mind. I don't know if I have this right. I don't know if I'm even close to what the end game of Attack on Titan is. As of this filming, I have yet to see Season 2. I haven't seen the Junior uh, Chibi anime yet. Season 3 is like fucking so close. I haven't read the manga yet. I am ex I'm extremely behind the Attack on Titan lore. But, ah, oh, I just want to keep diving in. I, I just... I gotta keep watching. <laughs> So alright guys, that about wraps up today's episode. What did you think of the Talking Titan? Oh my freaking god! What are your theories? Without spoilers though, I'll, 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 stop. Be nice. I know, right? It's stupid. I'm asking you to talk about theories and then I'm like, no spoilers, that's so dumb. What did you think of today's OVA? Do you guys like it? Do you guys hate it? Let's discuss. So leave me any positive or negative feedback down in that comment section. Feel free to like this video, subscribe to my channel, I appreciate it if you do. And as always, keep blessed, stay peaceful, and enjoy the rest of your day. Bye-bye.